Good evening YouTube viewers and subscribers. Yet again I've got another blank bench here which usually means I've got something pretty, pretty special to show you. I don't usually consider myself to be a very lucky type individual but this last week or so I felt very fortunate indeed. The reason I'm fortunate today is because of this. You look well, well it's just an old OS 4 stroke box. Yes it is and if you look at the price tag that's on this it says $224.95. This is not just any old OS 4-stroke. This is an FS60 open rocker 4-stroke. Something that I've always kind of wanted for a long time. Now there is a bit of a story that goes with this engine and I'll share it with you here shortly. But as you can see it comes with the actual instruction sheet. Some marketing literature the mounting template. This marketing literature is really interesting because when you get an engine with this you can tell if this is true and accurate or not by some of the engines that are in there and I have looked at this marketing literature and it is time period correct to match this engine. It doesn't show engines in here that are newer than the one that I've, is in the box. That's what I'm trying to say there. So here's the engine. <coughs> That's the engine. It came with some tools, a wrench, and a spanner, and it came with feeler gauges. Alright, let's get this stuff out of here now and let's look at this engine. Because the story that goes along with this engine, like I said, is rather interesting. When I first was looking at this online, it didn't have the drive thrust washer or anything here. None of this stuff was there, nor did it have the exhaust. So I was like, well, you know what? I'm going to offer considerably less than the fellow is asking because it's missing parts, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to find these parts or not, but I'm going to try anyway. Well, lo and behold, the fellow that sold this to me actually got this from an estate sale, <clears throat> and luckily for me, he happened to contact the the people that he got it from and asked them, hey, do you happen to have an old blue box that says OS on it? Uh, he was hoping that maybe the additional parts would be in there and lo and behold those people actually did have a box that said OS on it so he drove two hours round trip to go and get these few additional parts and that those parts being the box, the tools, the drive washer, nut, and prop washer. So that was fantastic. So I also obviously paid him a little bit more money than my original offer too. But even with that, I didn't pay anywhere close to what the box price is, nor anything what I think the engine could potentially be worth. But the beautiful thing about this engine is it's new. It's never been run. This is a new in the box engine. The only thing that I was told that the owner or the, the person that sold it to me was is that the owner would periodically put a few drops of oil in it to preserve it over time. And to me it looks like <clears throat> since the mounting template is out, maybe it was actually mounted in an airplane. But it's never been run that I can see. So this to me is an incredibly awesome find. I am super excited about this. The kicker with this thing is because it's brand new in the box, and it didn't come with this plug, I put this brand new plug in here. Actually, it's not a brand new plug, it's a used OSF plug. But the quandary I have is because this thing is new and pristine and it has really, really good compression, is that do I want to run it? Clearly, I'm not going to take it apart. I mean, I think that's what everybody would like me to do is take it apart. And I would kind of like to take it down to a certain level. I'd like to at least see the top of the head. But I really don't know if I want to do that either. So I want you guys to help me out here. And there will be a poll on this video that, uh, that I hope you'll answer, respond to and answer to kind of help me figure out what I need to do with this engine. Some of those choices could be, sure, run it, let's break it in, let's get some run videos of it. Other, another choice would be, don't ever run it. Just let it sit on your shelf and look beautiful. Another choice might be, go ahead and tear the damn thing down and let's see what it looks like inside. I don't really know. At this point, this is just kind of a quick look video because 
Honestly, I'm not really sure what I want to do with it. I really, really want to run it, but I'm not sure if I should. So anyway, I'm hoping the viewers and subscribers will help me out with this quandary I've got. But here's a quick look at this beautiful piece of OS history, the OS FS60 open rocker engine. <laughs> 